beautiful people! Welcome to another vlog. It's been a while. Well, it's Saturday today and I'm off and we are trying a local delicacy. The Gosetan Ftira, which is different from the Maltese Ftira. So the Maltese Ftira is more of a sandwich kind of thing. And the Gosetan Ftira is more of a pizza. And they have like these unique well, local Mediterranean toppings on them. I'm gonna show you guys around. Today we are checking out Mashok Bakery, which is the famous one for the Ftira, the local Ftira. So guys, we finally got the Gosetan Ftira right here. So it kind of looks like a pizza. We went for the ham and cheese one and it's topped with these baked sliced potatoes. Yes guys, carbs on carbs. But it's delish and we're gonna dig in. Another day, the other day you guys saw me eating the Gazetan Ftira. It was delish, delish. And today we went on a hike. It was a pretty sunny day and we're here at the lighthouse of Gozo. I'll show you guys the view in a second. And this used to be a fisherman's village and now it's known as a top restaurant and resort location actually for tourists. Good morning world! Happy Saturday! I apologize that the vlogs have been like kind of a mess lately. It's just because um, I actually moved! So I moved to my new place and work has been crazy so then obviously I've been MIA in the vlogs but I'm back now and today it's gonna be a really fun day it's early as you can see I just woke up but we are going to do a collab with a local photographer Magda from uh, Gozo Stories on Instagram I'm gonna make sure to link it down below we're going to three locations here in the island of Gozo we're going to Tapino, then we're going to the aqueduct, and then the beautiful citadel in the heart of Victoria. Hey guys, so the shoot is done. As you can see, I am leaving the citadel and I'm walking towards Victoria at the moment to do a little bit of exploring. So here in Victoria or here in Gozo on the weekends we usually have markets. So markets for anything like house stuff, they have vegetables and everything so I'm gonna go check it out because uh, it's pretty cool, it's pretty nice and the prices are cheaper of course. <laughs> I needed to get a cup of coffee and I got a little sandwich just to keep me up <laughs> and uh, continue the exploring of the city. So I passed by a little store and they were selling succulents and since I moved into a new place I couldn't resist, I had to get them. They're beautiful. 
I don't know if you could see them correctly in here, but they're gorgeous. I'm literally turning into a plant mom, but yeah, I'm sure they will look great. Hey guys, so I have just arrived home from a day walking around town and visiting the Gozo markets for the first time. I had a lot of fun and I want to show you guys the succulents I got. I was trying to show you in the bag, but you can really see it well. So first I got this little adorable cute one for two euros in the market. It's so beautiful. I still have to figure out where I'm going to place them around the house. And then I got this bigger one for four euros such a good deal so thank you so much guys for watching this vlog please don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and i will see you guys on the next video bye